Hi there precious people, this is European Stacker. Today we have a different video coming up and in this video I'm gonna show you some stacking tools. So what do I mean with stacking tools? Well, when I started as a stacker I found out that it was quite tricky to buy gold and silver or selling gold and silver um, because you always had to calculate the premiums by hand and I started to build tools for myself to make my stacking journey easier. And today we're gonna look at how you can use something that I call the buying silver and gold tool. So stay with me and let's dig in. Hi again, so first of all, thank you so much for watching my channel. I am very happy about it and very proud. I hope you're gonna enjoy this and that this is gonna provide you a lot of value. So what I mentioned before is I started to create some tools for my stacking journey and some of them I found to help me find good rates when I'm looking for gold and silver I can react much quicker and can contact buyers and I'm able to get those deals before anyone else. So how do I do this? Yeah, let's dig into this. So the first step that you have to do is going into europeanstacker.com. You can also search for European Stacker on Google and click here. So on my website, there is a tab called Member Rewards. These guys is your tab. Now, first of all, Member Rewards is a program that I started to reward everyone that is subscribed to my YouTube channel. And we already had a few giveaways already. Now, the Member Rewards you can see here and Basically, I won't ask you to do tons of things or anything like that to participate in the memory rewards. Um, it's enough that you are subscribed as uh, to my YouTube channel and I would be able to give away some cool coins. So don't forget to subscribe. Now, below on this page here, there is something called free member downloads and under the free member downloads, there's something called the European Stackers Gold Silver Premium Calculator. And I use this one on a daily basis and I'm gonna go through step by step how you do this. So first of all, you can click here and you download this one. And what will pop up here is the Premium Calculator. So don't be confused by all these different tabs. The only thing you need to focus on is either you can read the step-by-step -step instruction, but this video is kind of replacing exactly that. And here to the right, you have something that you need to fill in. And on the right side, this will be filled in automatically and calculated for you. So the first tab that we're going to look into is the premium calculator and the purpose of the premium calculator is to quickly for you calculate premium on either a specific coin or a lot and finding out what premium do I pay for this specific one. Do I get this coin under spot? Do I get it over spot? What is the premium? So let's dig into some examples. I'm going to go here into eBay. Just for the sake of it, I'm putting the eBay Spain because they have prices in euros. In the specific sheet, the prices is in euros, but you can easily switch that to US dollars, to Australian dollars, or whatever you prefer. So in this specific case, I'm walking around an eBay here and I'm looking at different coins and I'm finding a coin that I say, hey, this, this looks like a coin I want for my collection. 
Okay, so this specific coin is a five pesetas from Spain. And I'm going down here and I look and I can't find, you know, exactly the composition of the coin. So in this specific case, we're gonna look for it. Right, so here on this specific page, I used it sometime for Spanish coins. So we can go in here and we said, okay, this is a five pesetas and an older version. I'm gonna look at, this is the baby Carlos. So this specific one, <clears throat> right? So here we have all the numbers of the coin and we can see that this five pesetas is 90% silver and the total weight of 25 grams. So we go into this sheet here and we're gonna fill in 25 grams and the purity was 90%, so 0 0.900. And for this specific lot, now we are also gonna find out the silver price. So you can either click here to display that. I'm gonna go into this page here I really like the bullion vault for looking at prices. So in this specific case, you scroll down and you see that the silver price per gram in euros is 0 0.75. So this is what you're gonna fill in here, 0 0.75. And for this specific coin, you would pay 15.50 euros. So we're filling in 15.50 euros. And you can see that this specific coin has a fine content of 22.5 grams. The silver spot price for this specific one is 16.88. So we are actually having a 9% under spot for this specific coin, which is a pretty good deal uh, right now. Now, if the price of this coin instead was 19 euros, you would have a premium of 11% above spot, so there's an 11% premium on this. So this is a very quick way for you to calculate premiums as a stacker when you are researching prices and you're researching coins to buy. Normally I started to do this on paper, but right now I do this in this sheet and it saves me a lot of time. Now we're gonna dig in to the second tab on this sheet, which is the buy coin spot. And the purpose of the buy coin spot tab is basically for you to very quickly be able to tell what is the spot price for a specific lot of coins. So this can be very useful when you're looking and someone is selling, for example, 20 half dollars or you know 20 of something of the same kind. And we can look at the spot price for the whole lot. And basically we can start to look at a coin and say, I want this specific coin. We have an idea already, what is the spot price? And then we can start to research. So I find this super useful. I'm gonna give you guys an example. So we're gonna find a lot of this specific coin just to make it easier. And here we find exactly the same coin. This one has 13 coins of five pesetas and a weight of 325 grams. Now, we're going back to the spot. We have a silver price, what we had before, 0 0.75 euros. Here we had 13 coins, filling in 13. The coin weight per gram was 25 per coin and the purity was 90% silver. So we can see that if we are looking at the spot price for these coins, spot price would be around 1688. So everything that is one coin for under 1688, that's gonna be below spot. Everything that is above that is gonna be above spot. And for the lot price, something around 220 euros is gonna be around like spot price for this specific lot. So in this example here is 245. This is above spot, probably by you know, six, eight percent, something like that. 
but we can just now scroll through all of these eBay lots and we can look at you know different type of coin so here we said okay this six coins for 130 euros you know let's put in six coins here no it's actually 100 euros so this is like 30 euros above spot that's even more expensive and then we can just walk through here and here for example we have 10 coins and 170 so still you know around 30 euros extra as a premium and this way you know i typically just like sort out hey what is you know what is the cheapest lot here on the market and i'm just going through and i find good deals like this cool so this is the buy coin spot it's basically aiming to find out what is the specific spot price for you know a specific coin lot or coin now I'm gonna dig into the last tab here and I just want to stop up a bit and say thank you so much guys for watching this video I am really happy about if you know this sheet comes to good use for you and if it helps you stacking journey and if it helps you to buy cheaper gold and silver and um, so you know if you like this video so far gives it a thumbs up I'm very happy that you're still here with me right now so on the last piece here we have something called return of investment and I'm just gonna go through really quickly one thing so this is a graph of the silver price the last hundred years and what is interesting is that silver in around 1900 16 1917 so that's more than 100 years ago were around 17 you know maybe 18 dollars per ounce and just fast forward 100 years later you know around the same time frames so like 2017 18 we can see that the silver price have more or less been steady over 100 years course i don't say that we don't have those big tops here you know silver were up at even above 100 you know at one point in 1979 and one thing is sure we don't know exactly what's going to happen to silver let's stop up for a moment and say i'm extremely bullish when it comes to silver short term right now or even long term i do believe that silver price is going to go up but we don't know that and the fact that we don't know that one thing is for sure even if you invested during this whole time depending on when you invested in many cases you could at least kind of get back your investment and the reason why you could get back your investment is because if you were holding cash instead of silver then this cash would lose value over time in inflation while the silver price would be more kind of steady and you would earn money while cash would actually go down so the only thing that we can say for sure is that silver no matter if the price is going to go up or down it is a great protector against inflation it's a great protector of your wealth and your savings just as gold so the last tab of this sheet is called return of investment and this basically is created to give you just a quick summary of how many years does it take for your investment before you're breaking even and it's calculating the premium of the coins I will give you an example so I'm gonna take you to European Mint which is one of my favorite places for buying gold and silver and you can see that the cheapest coin they have right now is Canada silver maple and this specific one goes for 28 to 21 we can also go back and we look at the silver per ounce price which is 2317 so I'm gonna fill in here and it's already filled in 2317 and the price that you would pay for this specific maple is 28 21 so 28 and 21 
and the inflation in most countries in Europe has been around 2%. That's typically the central bank's kind of, you know, goal or, you know, aim to keep the inflation around 2%. I think in US is closer to 3%. So in this specific example, uh, I've been putting a standard inflation per year around 2.5%. What does that mean here is that the price that you're paying above spot, so the premium that you're paying, the inflation that it's going to take before the price that you pay is basically going back to be the spot price. So, you know, basically before you're breaking even with your investment, assuming that you can sell your coin for a round spot, is going to be 8.7 years. So why is this important? You know, many people buy silver today in the hope that they will be able to sell that silver very quickly and make a profit from it. And as I said before, I do believe that silver is going to go up right now, but no one knows about that. And because of that, we can always assume that silver is at the very least a good investment to protect your wealth. However, if you hold the silver for a longer period of time, Let's say that instead of a maple, I bought a higher premium coin that would cost 35 euros. Now suddenly, the years before, the investment would break even, assuming that inflation is 2.5, it's actually 20 years. So now ask yourself, you know, if you're not 100% sure that silver prices is gonna stay the same for you know the next 10 years, think about it, if you're buying a high premium coin today, it might take you up to 20 years before you can get back the money that you spend on this specific specific coin. So this is not to say stopping you from an invest. This is just a kind of like wake up tab where you say, you know what, I should actually try to get, um, you know, good prices on my coins. I should not be carried away by my emotions because in the end, if I buy a high premium coin, it could take very long time before I can get that money back. So the return on investment tab is just looking at, assuming that the prices stay the same for silver and gold, how many years is it gonna take for me to break even before I get back my investment that I pay for the silver. So just in short guys, just going through one last time, you know, the premium calculator is just quickly to calculate the premium on a coin or a lot. The buy coin spot calculator is to calculate what is the spot price for a specific coin or a lot. So you can quickly research the market for, you know, different offers that is closer to spot. And the return investment tab is basically how many years does it take for your investment to break even, assuming that you're paying a premium on a silver coin or a gold coin? I really hope that I've been providing value to you today and that you will use this sheet as much as I do. I use this sheet on a daily basis. Every time I'm buying a silver coin, I have this sheet up in the background to make this quite quick calculation for me. And I really wanted to share this with the stacking community. Now, if you appreciate this, this, you know, if you're using this sheet, if you like what you see, um, please leave a comment down below in this video. I would love to hear more of your opinion on it. And specifically, if you start to use the sheet and you say, hey, European Stacker, there's something that I'm missing on this specific sheet. Could you please add that? I would love to hear that in the comments field below. If there's something that I can do on the sheet that you're missing today, something that you think could be better. So again, if you enjoyed this video, I would be very happy if you subscribed and if you are you know, looking at collecting European silver coins, getting access to cool tools like this that help in your stacking everyday journey, you know, uh, let me know. Thanks so much for watching guys. It's been a pleasure to have you here. I'm looking forward to see you soon again. Have a good night.